Humblekeys.com. Uh, it's we're just all going to share music together. Um, no one's better than anyone else. Uh, we're going to do something different. Uh, actually, you're going to go back and touch on "I Will Bless the Lord" by Byron Cage. Uh, I didn't get to finish it, and, and I, looking back, I really didn't like the production quality. But um, but it's a real simple song, real repetitive. Um, it's in the key of G flat or F sharp. So uh, let's go ahead and go over the scale. G flat, Ezra 1. A flat, Ezra 2. B flat, Ezra 3. C flat, 4B, Ezra 4. D flat, Ezra 5. Flat, Ezra 6, F, Ezra 7, and back to the G flat, Ezra 1. All right, uh, I'll break it up in, in, in three quick parts. Kind of want to want to move through it quickly because, like I said, it's real simple. And it's got a lot of smooth chords that you can use, not in just this song, but you can actually go and uh, and work it out in different different progressions in other songs. Uh, so you, you're not just limited to, to using it in this song. But... Um, the first part. All right, spell it out. So your first chord, uh, left hand. So. slide off the B flat slide off your B flat and you have a B D flat E flat and a G flat so three chords. You have an A flat, 
and you have a B flat. And yes, I am cheating by using <laughs> my thumb over two four uh, two uh, two notes. Um, so that's your left hand. Your right hand. All right. So you're going to slide grace off of the. Uh, Off the E flat, so so we do uh, D flat, E flat, F, and A flat, and I'll show you the timing. All right, one more time. All right, so let's run that. So you got. change while doing this because you have you have the chorus you have the verse uh, so forth the only thing that's going to change is your rhythm so uh, you got play around with it all right let me show you that let me show you that little uh, that little bridge part between uh, let's go uh, it's a uh, very easy Basically, you're picking up on the scale, so um, we go E flat, F, G flat, A flat, and a B flat. So, so let's put it all together. Switch. Um, let's see. All right. So let me show you that one. Uh, the diminished chord, and then I'll show you the new rhythm. So we got. All right. So what I'm doing is I'm playing just a single D on the left hand, and on the right hand I'm using an A flat, B, a D, an F. And an A flat, so that's the same thing. It's the same diminished chord. So we're gonna go. into this real smooth uh it's basically the bass drops out uh and it's and you it's just you the keyboard player playing on uh playing while they're singing that 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 little uh that verse so um let's see i'll play it for you Let's, let's let's get those out now this is going to be a, little, a, a nice little spread for you to work on and, and like I said we're all getting better by doing this but uh okay let's go um, first chord so left hand you have a flat you have an E flat and you have a G flat right hand you have a uh, B flat, B, C flat, B, C flat, whichever one you want to 
follow. Uh, D flat, uh, E flat, and have G flat. So, and just slide off of that uh, B flat. So, and just practice the one. All right, all right. So. small chunks because you get your your muscles actually remember your hand position so practice it correctly and slowly and and you'll be playing in no time uh but uh anyway and just keep doing that keep doing that something a little different with the left hand. In your left hand, you have a D and you have a, you have an F. It's a little bit of a spread. You'll get used to it. And on your right hand, you have the, 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 that D diminished again. Um, you have an A flat. You have a B. You have a D. You have an F. And you got another A flat or not the higher. So let's do it again. chunks and then you add on top of those chunks and practice all over again and practice slowly uh, sometimes we have to humble ourselves uh, and we always want to get the licks faster and faster and faster for everybody else uh, but uh but it, it it's more effective practicing slowly give your body a, a chance to memorize it uh, over and over and over again sometimes it gets boring but but it's beneficial uh, anyway so got Flat, a G flat, and you have a B, 
that, you're going to go to the E flat, G flat, and a B. Yeah, I don't want to add in that E flat, so I mean you can. It's a all right. Your next note. B flat, you have a D, and you have an F. Your right hand, you have a D, an F, and you have a B flat. Well, it's basically the same chord of both hands, just inversion. Uh, it's just a different, uh, a different inversion. Can't get my words out. It's a B flat. All right. So let's put it all together. Same note that we did, uh, same chord that we did uh, a couple minutes earlier. Got an A flat, got a B, got a D, got an F, and you have an A flat. And it's that same, it's that same, uh, that, that same diminished chord, a D diminished. going to be an E flat and a G flat. Right hand is going to be a B flat and an E flat. All right, next chord. It's going to be an F and an A flat on your left hand and your right hand is going to be a D flat and an F. That's basically a, a D flat major chord. So, first two. All right. Next chord. You got a E flat and a G flat. And on your right 
hand you have a B flat, a D flat, and a G flat. So, all right, we're going to do another diminished chord. I like that chord too. I don't. It, it's different. The different inversions of, of the diminished chord that you play, uh, it has a different flavor. It just depends on where you are. No. So, of the voicing in the in the album this, this chord so let's go yeah i think that's the, yeah i like that voice okay so uh left hand you have an e flat sorry about that uh you have a g and you have a b flat that's your left hand and on your right hand you have a d flat you have an e you have a g and you have a B flat. So let's do it again. I like that right there. I'll do it slowly one more time. Right. One more time. The song is really, really easy. There's no more spreads or anything like that. Um, uh, next progression is 